Alrighty and welcome. This is Resident Evil 3. Um, nightmare mode is what we are going to do. Um, I've played through on standard and hardcore and I heard that nightmare mode uh, rearranges items and enemies so pretty excited to check that out. Enemies behave more aggressively, enemy attacks are much stronger, enemies and items appear in different locations. Hell yeah. So I'm pretty excited to check this out. I wanted to do my first playthrough streaming it, but I was playing with my son and he's still a bit camera shy, so. But we'll uh we'll go through this and kind of see what the differences are. <laughs> This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Angry mobs the city, building. Authorities are bracing for more rioting tonight. He was knocked unconscious. A uh, citywide emergency has been declared. The CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern region of the U.S. Officials Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the core values that create the foundation right. for Umbrella. Oh. Of Umbrella. Of Umbrella. <laughs> it's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. Pretty bright looking future. This was my favorite game growing up as a kid. So it is pretty sweet. Hey, Murek. Hello again. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> I will try not to get my ass kicked. Yeah, I just started over on nightmare mode. I wanted to check out the differences. Hope it's coming through okay for you. I'm not sure how the internet's doing here. It's kind of sometimes in, sometimes not. <laughs> I'm recording it as well so that I can upload it later in case it uh, doesn't do too hot. Every night. Three more days. 
then I can kiss this town goodbye. What's going on out there? Sounds like a ruckus. It's quite a bit of pills you got there, Jill. Mm. Too many pills. I love how every time I play through this game, I notice more details and stuff in the scenery. It's already been two months since that mess with Umbrella. Thanks to the suspension, investigations have progressed exactly as I'd hoped. Perhaps this written record of what I've found will prove to be my final duty as a STARS officer. I can only hope that it helps lead to the truth. Those infected by the virus seem to become literal zombies. It appears to be communicable via several different avenues outlined below. Light from an infected individual, allowing the mixing of bodily fluids, contact with crows which have eaten infected carrion, and due to the strength of the virus, airborne infection cannot be discounted. It should be noted that those who survived the incident have not yet developed symptoms. It's unclear whether this is because the virus has a long incubation period or because we just happen to be resistant to the infection. We ought to remain vigilant even after this investigation period ends. As for me, aside from my minor difficulties sleeping, I seem to be in fine shape. Still, I shouldn't get too hopeful. After all, this could just be an extended incubation. Which would be kind of worrisome about going into the public. Investigation notes. Pharmaceuticals company, industry leader, and market share. Focuses on military weapons development while maintaining cover as a pharmaceutical company. Also recently developing bioweapons. T-virus outbreak at Arclid. Ooh, excuse me. Arclay Mountains Research Facility predicted the mansion incident. Conspiring with Raccoon City leadership, large donations to Mayor Warren's office effectively controls the city. Sorry, one second. Unsealed envelope. They've got me pinned down at home. Guys across the street are watching me from their window 24-7. Are they Ironsmen? Umbrellas? I don't know. And there's no real difference anyway. I know what they're trying to do. They want to wear me down, torment me into compliance, and it's working. I'm barely eating, barely sleeping. I'm going crazy. I feel like the living dead. But I won't let them win. I have to get out of the city and find a way to make them accountable. They'll s send someone to silence me, of course. You hear that I've been killed or whatever, it see it is they do to people like me. You must pick up the investigation where I left off. I've enclosed my files. They'll tell you everything you need to know. As long as this package isn't intercepted, I'll be moving out at night. Five days. Wish me luck. Right. Message from a colleague. To Jill Valentine. Hey Hotshot, how are you holding up? I still can't believe Iron suspended you. It's such bullshit. You ought to pin a medal on you for making it out of that hellhole back in July. Of course you're going to poke around and ask questions about it. I hope you're not mad at me for keeping my head down. Everything's been happening so fast. Stars was the pride of the force. When the chief disbanded us out of nowhere, I thought for sure I was going to lose my job. Word has it you're planning to leave Raccoon City. I figured you wouldn't take the suspension lying down. Just promise to watch your back. Umbrella won't sit by while you try to dismantle their business. Take care, Jill. Brad Vickers, Stars Alpha Team, now and forever. P.S. Had to slip this message to the pizza guy to avoid detection. Enjoy the extra large Mega Meat Supreme. It's on me and the guys. Mmm. Delicious. Anything else? Some soup, too? Nice. It's a good choice. Anything else? Beer, milk, some donuts. Bread. Kijimasu. Jane. Jill has a real problem with wasting water. There's that pretty face. Good thing she didn't drink the water then, this would be a lot shorter game. Huh. 
Who could that be? Hello? Jill, are, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my... Checking out the neighbor's place. Oh, they're going to... Luckily, Nemesis is taken. What the hell? No way. It's like you shouldn't go over the balcony right then. Chick Joe. Right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town, you and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. How did this all happen so fast? I don't know. One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like Arclay on steroids. Think about it. We're gonna make a run for 
it. Come on, Phil. We know how this ends. No, I don't. Are we still a team? Always. Then do me a favor. Don't fuck up like I do. Go! No! This game is great, but I really wish there was a lot more exploring of the streets and stuff. But... You're not worth the bullets. Crazy! Okay, yeah, that's what I like. Already facing zombies and shit. Hell yeah. Constructive no criticism, sir. For you. I'm not going anywhere. I'd rather starve to death than here to be eaten by one of those undead monsters. Uh, now leave me alone. I like how he ended with his original lines. Alright, let's keep going. Zombies. Luckily, they don't reach right through. Oh, shoot. Oh, got a survival problem. So I thought he was going to fight me for sure. Damn it! 
I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? Name's Carlos. I'm saving you. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. This is just down. All right. Well, I can definitely see the zombies are a hell of a lot faster, more aggressive. I think we're in the clear. There's an extra one in there Hope already. So. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Is that oh, you, on. Carlos? Is that you? Dipshit to close this. Chris. Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. <laughs> Listen, I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. UBCS for short. What? Are you kidding oh, me? Oh, really? Are you fucking kidding That's me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Well, we're just here to help people. What's uh, wrong with Umbrella? Yeah. What's, what's wrong, what's with, wrong umbrella? with umbrella? Oh my god. Your company is responsible for oh, infecting well, everyone. Besides that. Yeah. I don't know anything about all that. Look, you don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Do I have a choice? Come on. It's this way. This game doesn't give you a lot of alternate routes. In a video game, kind of on a set path here. I really gotta try and find more of those Mr. Uh, Charlies. Alright, let's meet the guys. See who would do. Where are you? There's a train car. Hey, Captain. Here. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos. You didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Jill. Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, Platoon Leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? This city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. 
My men cannot do this alone. Yeah, they need a hero. They need a star's operative. And Chris is out of All town. Right. I'm in. But I am on their side. Not yours. Oh, hey, I'm on your side, guys. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. Yeah, don't mention it. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find some Yeah, don't worry. There. You just saved my life and you're sitting me out there all by myself. Good to know. Tabloid front page. Accountable murders, a complete digest. In the gray of the morning on September 25th, a frantic caller telephoned the RPD to report an assault. A man described as disheveled like a vagrant was attacking a passerby north of the Lambs Museum of Art. The responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpsters nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body and she had been dismembered, suggesting she had been eaten. The third known incident of this kind to occur in Raccoon City this month. So who done it? Who's been munching on man steak? We here at News Comet have a gnawing feeling that the so-called cannibal disease patient Spencer Memorial has been providing free treatment for since August might not be settling for just the cafeteria food. Our reporters have infiltrated Spencer Memorial, asked the tough questions, and come back with horror stories that will make your stomach royal. Turn the page for the scoop. Apparently there wasn't a page left. Side yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You mind getting the subway infrastructure back online? And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Fuck yeah. Yeah, like. The Magnum? That's what I thought it was. You get the Magnum right away? Oh, I know I'm in some shit now. Now I'm intrigued. Just give me something like that. Maybe I'm in my for quite a show. I'm gonna walk out there, there's Hunter Betas all over. UBCS, Herb Field Manual. There's no place in the UBCS for pipsqueaks who crawl back to base every single time they get scratched up. You want somebody to kiss your boo-boo? Go someplace else. Here in the big leagues, we mix our own meds, so get these recipes memorized. Yes, sir. High potency mixture, green herb times two. Maximum potency mixture, green herb plus red herb. Or oh, green herb times three. First aid spray. Can't make these yourself. Grab them if you see them. That should do it. Now let's get this done and then go grab a beer. I apologize, let's get that last document because I was like, ah, oh, it just tells me how to make gunpowder, but really should have read it. Yeah, my other hip pouch. I bought one of them. And I also got myself the Samurai Edge. Which, I'm not quite sure if that's going to really be better than the completely upgraded handgun, but figured I'd give it a short. Haha, <laughs> pun intended. All right. Let's see. Yeah, I got a, got a lot of hardcore. Nightmare. Alright, let's see how we do. Alright, I apologize to everybody viewing if I just run in there and just get fucking money. <laughs> More survivors. We've gotta get that train moving. You're just a pipsqueak zombie. I'm not gonna waste my ammo on you. Holy shit, that's that's a lot more zombies. That's a lot of zombies. Oh, 
Go jump. Go 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 go. Go. Oh fuck. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's a guy. There's a guy. Run, run, Jill. Run. There is an angry mob behind you. There's a lot of zombies. Holy balls. Yeah. Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. <sighs> Fuck you. Safety behind the fence. Now what you gonna do, huh? Nothing. Nothing. Suspicious. Big wheel? Anybody? Anybody here? See if it's the same. Hell yeah! Didn't even bother changing the codes to replace you. Okay. Okay, so no point in taking that. Drugstore Owner's Journal, August 24th. This new hair tonic from Umbrella is just flying off the shelves. The stuff they make always works wonders, so it's no surprise. I was counting on this and ordered a huge shipment. My instincts are paying off, literally. I just know sales will continue to rise as word gets out. That said, the string of violent incidents on the news has me worried. Maybe I ought to invest in a good safe to hold all this cash that's rolling in. September 2nd. The new safe is just perfect. Nobody knows the code, not even my wife. It's a secret between me and my beautiful Aqua Cure Queen. And she'd never give it up for a thief. Oh, yeah, totally. Even though there's no cash in there, just a weird scope. Oh. 
I really do want the shotgun ammo, but. Uh, Use it. That shit's just too quiet. So is that just a wall down there? see a crowd over there, but that's, it's actually more worrisome not to see all the enemies than it is for them to already be there. Grab and go, grab and go. As much as you can. Anything that's in here, grab it all. Oh, come on now. Um, I had to go and pick up that scope I didn't know you did. Drop that off. Save. <sighs> this is a rush. This is pretty good. I do like it on nightmare mode. For sure. I love the. Hey, sir. Sir. Sir, I need you. I need you to stop doing that. Sir. He's gonna break that door. I don't even know how to use a handle. Right, here, grab this ammo.
street is actually quite quiet compared to uh, other difficulties. You silly zombie. He's over there still wandering around. You don't know where he's at. Yeah, he's dead. Enough messing around. And Mr. Zombie out. This must be the subway company's offices. I don't have the lock paper. Kite Bros. Railway Manual. Ensuring safe subway operations. In the event of a power outage, the subway will automatically cease operations. Once power has been restored, Please use the control panel to confirm the stations at which the train will stop, as well as which track segments will be used. If the route entered is unsafe, an error will occur and operations will not resume. Pretty straightforward. I need to get power back. Nothing. Okay, so it looks like the bobbleheads are transferred from the difficulty to difficulty. You're gonna jump out at me as soon as I grab this hose? I knew that! Alright, where's the other zombie? Wait. Ah, oh, she morphed into one too. Well, fine, it's gonna be like. Holy shit! Oh, I pressed dodge! I really want to save that grenade. Where the hell did you come from? I'd like to know where the hell that guy came from. You can't just randomly throw him in there like that. Jeez. There's got to be a logical way for him to show up than just appear out of thin air. Maybe he was on the ground or something. I just didn't see his corpse. What? What the hell? That was bullshit. I call shenanigans. Yeah. Subway employees memo. Violence getting worse and worse these past few days. Got a shotgun for when it hits a breaking point. Lock it up in the gun rack. That should keep it safe from any would-be looters while I go out and try to find some more shells. If things go south, cut the chain and bust out that sucker. I pray we all make it out alive. Okay, I got more of that, more of that, more of that. I just gotta make it back to the fire hydrant without getting fucked up. Okay, 
much. I'm not sure. Could try through the donut shop way. They didn't open up that shortcut. Dumb. Dumb. Oh well. I made it regardless. Oh, thank you. My nightmare mode. I shouldn't need a tutorial. Had to beat the game. To get this mode on. Uh, there. Okay. Okay, kind of trying to save it. My, oh my gunpowder for when I absolutely need it. Knife. All I really need that for is breaking crates open early. Okay. Is someone in here? Be right back. I gotta open a window. It's, it's hot in here. It's hot. Can you be see us? Yeah, careful, careful. Come on, don't look at me like that, alright? I'm not an effective. Right, no, 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 wait, please! No. What the fuck? He was infected. He might have been infected. Oh, stars, this soft. No wonder so many of you dead. And what are you, UBCS, killing your own people? He would have turned. There's your sense of self-preservation. Go back to the subway station. We don't need a bleeding heart like you getting in the way. All right, and I'm back. Oh, let's do this. Got on my Himbana gloves for keeping uh, hands from sweating and stuff. It's supposed to be good for arthritis, I guess, or blood flow. Training log, July 10th. Suck at prison, the Umbrella Corporation just recruited me for a job. A job! Don't know how they're gonna wipe out a life sentence for murdering 20 gangbangers, but whatever. I'll take it. Beat shitting away the rest of my days behind bars. I gotta get back into shape. July 26th. Caught the chain yesterday and got moved to a UBCS training camp, where I fired my first bullet in two whole years. Missed a stationary target about five inches at 400 yards. I never fucking do that. It's like I forgot everything. Doesn't matter. I'll get shot again. Watch me. Try 26. So, uh, while Jill was in the mansion shooting zombies, this guy was in training. Target practice at 600 yards. Two misses. Okay, I've got my shot grouping down to three inches. Feeling good, feeling good. After lunch, they put me through my first mock battle. The Cap and the other guys are good people, and goddamn beasts of war at that. At that what the fuck is up with that lunatic Nikolai? Use me as a fucking human shield just to score some extra points. Target practice, 600 yards, no misses. Murphy's back, baby. You'll never see me miss another target. Tomorrow, I go on my first mission, riot control in Raccoon City. I think Jimmy would have liked it. My brother was always the first to reach out and help people, right up until those street punks took him away from me. Now it's my turn to do some good for a change, the way I know best. And then Nikolai just took him out like a son of a bitch. Fucking Nikolai, I'll get you! After I get a shotgun. Alright, 
I want that shotgun. I'm going for it right now. I'm not gonna wait. Should open that shortcut. supplies in here now. Oh, at least there's that. Anything else? It's kind of weird that you can't control your flashlight. And she only puts it on sometimes, but not in all dark. There's fucking nobody there. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> I just run past a zombie. Who knows what's gonna get me? They're like, oh, it's quiet. There's nobody here. Parasites! enough bullets to finish that one off. But that's all about to change. Shotgun. Glad uh, no enemies respawned in here. That would kind of suck. Thank you. Oh, that's it? All right. Yeah. 
Probably go through this way to open up that shortcut. As I said, I could have sworn I had a lot more gunpowder than that. Because we can make a lot of shotgun. This shotgun, it is so good. Alright. been a poor choice. Oh, I should have saved and then done this. I just got rid of all my gunpowder. I'll just do that. <laughs> I might have just screwed myself doing that. I was just so excited to have so much like gunpowder to make shotgun. My shotgun. CS suicide note. The Middle East, Eastern Europe, East Africa. I thought I knew what the hell was. What hell was. Figured I'd never crack, no matter what was thrown at me. But this job, this was one was supposed to be easy. Quick wage, I'd earned it. It all happened at once. There were 30 guys in our squad, all armed with state-of-the-art assault rifles, and yet we were wiped out in less than 48 hours. I've been through enough shit to know it only even gets worse. And if that was just the beginning, Maybe I'm a coward. I don't care. This is the only way out I have left. I just hope my body doesn't get back up after I pull the trigger. Poor bastard.
electricians notice. Public use generators. Due to the ongoing power outages, the guild has decided to provisionally place a number of electrical generators through the city. Everyone is too welcome to use them, but remember these generators are running high voltage currents. If one were to be struck or impacted by gunfire, anyone standing nearby would get electrocuted. This must be a really bad city. You got that. If you see a generator spitting sparks, don't go near it. Don't do anything stupid. Safety first. As the saying goes, if we make it through this mess, I'll have plenty of busted generators for sale at bargain price. It's your neighborhood electrician, Sam. I wonder if this city was a lot like, um, like where the rich are really rich and the poor are really poor and crime is really fucking bad. So if you're like, you know, oh shit. See how this is gonna be. Oh, come on. Couldn't even die. That was nice tactics there, Nemesis. Find a bunch of guys that can still reach me on the other side of the fence. City's dog. Some more gunpowder. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. I press dodge! I press dodge! To all employees, in response to the violent outbreaks across the city, we have implemented an intentional power outage. Once the situation has been brought under control, please activate the four breakers ASAP. Once that's done, turn on the main power switch in the control room to reactivate the power grid. Smells like a big giant spider turd? Yeah, it sounds about right. Ugh. They work. 
It was starting to look like Chad was never going to come back from his round, so I poked my head in there and fuck me, next thing I know I've got some kind of maggot squirming down my throat. I was gagging and heaving, but those little bastards didn't seem to mind none. They just wouldn't come up. I was staggering around like a madman, and then I saw it. A green herb. My grandma once told me that green herbs are natural bug deterrent, so I grabbed one, shoved it down my gob, and swallowed. And what do you know? The little things didn't want to be in there anymore. I've never been so happy to throw up. I'm going to head back out there to look for Chad. If anyone else sees this, remember, eat your greens. Salads are delicious. I love salads. They're so yummy. Salad, salad, salad. Mm -mm -mm. Substation internal menu. The key to the high voltage area has gone missing, and the earliest we'll be able to get a replacement is in... is... is the week? Anyway, in the interior, a lockpick will be provided to the senior employee on duty. We only have one lockpick and cannot afford to lose it, so please keep it in the carrying case at all times when you're not using it. And please, could you all check just once more that you did not accidentally take the key home? If you happen to find it, please bring it to Kate and Admin. Spider? Spider? I heard something skittering while I was reading that document. I don't like that. Well, see? You should have handed it in to Kate, but you just didn't. Look what happened. That's a pretty fancy box you got there. Not like a product utility box or anything, it's just this nice carved wooden box. Oh yeah, that's God. that's pretty fucking gross. Dude. That's what you get for drinking the water in Mexico. <laughs> just kidding. See if I can do this. Oh, I already see that big bastard skittering around in there. Ew. Here we go. Oh no. No, Joe. Just go through the door. Don't wait. No. Always look up. Always look up. Oh my god. You know, I was thinking that these spiders are actually like flea G virus hybrids or something. Like, apparently they obviously have like some spider or other insect DNA, but like the, the way their bodies are shaped and like the way they reproduce and, you know, surround themselves in these organic nests, pretty much like the, the G adults did. So it could be like maybe a or something that fed on a G adult. Hey buddy, you got this. You got this, Joe. You got this. You can do it. Oh god, dead end. You got this. You got this. You got this. Come on, you little bastards. Oh, come on! Oh, 
Oh, come on! I pressed dodge. But doesn't heal me. Fuck. Come on! It's okay, it doesn't heal you. It just. You got rid of your stats, now, man, but you're still gonna die. So you pretty much like have to stop pulling the lever so you can turn around and blast those suckers. Trick those little bastards like they're tricking you. Chad's notes. What happened to this place? I've seen some strange shit over the past few days. Those strange bugs building their nests? That metallic smell wafting through the vents? But fuck if it didn't all go straight to hell overnight. I need to check in on my ma uptown, but the boss says I can't leave till I drop all the breakers. God damn it. Better finish up quick so I can get out of here. Well, fuck me. My stomach hurts so much I can hardly move. At the last breaker, a big ugly bastard of a bug got the drop on me and shoved a big fucking tube down my throat. I managed to get away and somehow kept from vomiting up on the spot. Fuck, it hurts. Feels like something moving inside. Holding it together, can't believe I haven't puked. Fuck, it hurts. Like I'm gonna tear apart. I think this is it for me. I love you, mama. Yeah, but not seriously, like how those like little bastards look and stuff, like it does definitely seem like they're infected by the G virus and everything. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. We got this, we got this, we got this. You can do it, Joe. You can do it. So it is back there. No, no. It's back there. Fancy box. There's a. There was a fancy box back there?
I gotta get this pants box. Oh, damn, that's tricky bastards. I'm glad I checked the map, because uh, that would have really sucked. Okay, so I just got to go right around there. So good. Oh, come on! Ugh! I fucking hate that. Oh, I fucking hate that. If you hit the fucking run button facing that direction, you stop aiming. Oh, I'm so fucked. Yeah. Oh, damn it. Right there. Last fucking one. Such bullshit. I hate... Uh, I hate that. The character is facing the camera. When you go to aim, you don't fucking aim. And it's annoying. Gotta be luring them by pulling the breaker and flip around and blast them into little bits. Chad's notes. I did read those earlier. Good, we're on that. up this time. I got you all figured out.
Well, that was a hell of a Okay. Way. All that leaves is the main power switch. Enjoy that. Oh, yeah. I wonder, is there anything different if you go back in there? Alright, we're gonna save real quick. I'm gonna go check that out. Fancy box, keep that, keep that. Yeah, okay. Save. Check this out. It's probably not, it's probably all the same going back in, but I just want to see if there's actually a down nest in here. You can do it. Oh yeah, fuck you. See, and they don't even have, like, eight main legs. They have six, so, like... And they do have, like, other little legs and shit like that, but... I can hear them crawling around. But, yeah. My theory stands that they're, like, more like fleas that in fed on like a G adult or something and which made them turn into these obnoxious little bastards oh it's on the other side You can do it, Joe. All right. But anyway, I'm gonna stop it here for now. I just wanted to explore around and see if anything had changed since uh, the dropping of the nest. But it didn't look like anything did. Uh, Nightmare mode, pretty fun. It is cool to see the remix of the enemies. I was kind of hoping to see like maybe some other monsters uh, sooner, or like maybe see the spiders outside of their nest or something. But that's probably asking for a lot. But Nightmare mode is pretty cool. It's definitely a like on the, the remix and the placement I just keeps it fresh. So uh, until next time, take it easy. Be safe out there. Don't get infected. <laughs> and thanks for watching. Bye.